guys, it's Stem Boy, and today I'm going to be teaching you how to make a random selection app in MIT App Inventor 2. So first of all, let's start a new project and name it Random Selection. Next, we're going to want to uh, drag in a vertical arrangement and make the height fill parent and the width fill parent and make the alignment center and center. And let's change the background color to this dark blue. Next, I'm going to drag in a label, make the font size 30, make the text just a minus sign, and make the color white. And we're going to add in 1, 2, 3 buttons. And a list view one, and let's make the list view color the same as the background. So go to custom and copy this color. Go to list view one and make the background color custom and paste that number in and make this button so what So now we're going to, uh, one more thing, we're going to add an uh, activity starter as well. So now we're going to go into the block section and we're going to do button one. So button one is the select one, the selection one, and make one for each, button two. In button three, and we're also going to need a variable. Uh, I'm going to call it so selection, and set it to create an empty list. For button one, we're gonna make an activity. So let's set activity starter action one to pick random item, and the list we're gonna pick it from is the variable we, that we made before. So it's selection. And then start activity and set label one text to the action. So now we have to make the list and uh, one thing I forgot to add before, so we're going to need a text box and 
we're gonna add items. So button two is the add button. So we're gonna do when button two clicked. List we want set elements to uh, we're gonna have global selection and text box one. And go to the list area and get add items to the list and we're gonna do the list is global selection and the item is text box one text we're gonna set text box one text to nothing so it clears that afterwards and we're gonna set list view one elements to variable get global selection and when button three click we're gonna want to remove an item from the list so remove item and the list we're gonna do is get global selection and to make it clearer for the user we're gonna do remove last item and index and it's going to be one and we're going to set list view one elements to the variable So that's a random selection app. So let's go test it out. Testing out our random selection app. So let's add, um, let's add apple. So let's say I'm deciding what fruit I want to eat. So let's add apple, banana, and orange grape and um plum so we can select and you might receive an error message. It doesn't mean anything. Your selection's up there, so it chose great. And let's do next time. We got banana. We got banana again. Now we got apple. Now we got orange. Now let's remove uh the last item on this list. So it's apple. Then we can remove everything. So that's how our app works hope you liked it hope you learned something new if you like this video please like and subscribe uh see you next time